Hi, I want to talk about this really good product that I use. It's a Lafia Shea Butter. For those who are, you know, wanting to go more towards natural cosmetics, this is a really great product to use for all of our moisturizer. You can put it on your face, you can put it in your hair, you can use it head to toe. And so this is really great for that. There are a number of different brands of shea butter out here on the market. This is the best one that I've used so far and I've tried plenty of them. So I just want to talk a little bit about it today in case you're looking to maybe switch from using, you know, fragrance lotions to something that's more natural. I think that this is definitely the product to use. So again, this is the Alafi Shea Butter. It's unscented. Now, this particular one is unscented. They do come in a variety of different fragrances that you can get. If you're using it to replace a scented lotion, then yes, I would recommend you get one of these scented ones. But if you're looking to put it on your face, on your lips, you know, all over, as I said before, you're going to want to get the unscented one. I am a huge advocate for not using scented or colored things, cosmetics specifically on your face. I think that it can cause irritation and breakout and you just don't want that. So if you're planning to use it all over, definitely get the unscented brand. So you can get a good idea of how big the jar is. So this is an 11 ounce jar. That is a lot of product. This is going to last you at least a few months. You're not going to go through this in a couple weeks. Because of the way that the shea butter is packed, it is hard, but when you scoop it out, you can rub it in between your hands to kind of loosen it up. It goes on all over. It's going to give you that feeling all day long. So you're not going to need to use with so much of this. But just to give you a good idea of how big it is, I have a CD here. I'm going to put it on top here so you can see the comparison. It's nowhere near as big as this CD. However, again, this is an 11 ounce jar. So this is not portable. It's way too big to put in your bag. It's not going to fit in your purse. So you're not going to want to take this with you. What I like to do is I like to scoop a little bit out of it at a time. And I have separate containers that I like to put in. I have like a little pot so that I can use it as a hand cream. I have like a little bit of a smaller jar so I can kind of scoop it out throughout the day and use it as a lip balm, which is actually really excellent. So this is not portable. Also, it's very heavy because there is so much product packed into this one jar. So you're not going to want to take this with you. But however, it is heart plastic. The jar and the top both are heart plastic. So you can drop this on the floor. It's not going to break. It's not going to crack. So it's totally safe. But again, it is heavy. So not a portable product. But it's scoopable so you can put it in other containers if you wanted to take some with you. So this jar is used. I've had this for about a month now. And as you can see, there is plenty of product left in it. You can see that it's still filled to the rim here so a month later I haven't used all of this which is amazing so when you get it brand new there's going to be a styrofoam film over top of this as you can see there's kind of a little bit of residue left over of that and you peel it off and it'll be a smooth surface of the product right to the rim here as you can see I've been using this but it's packed with product I'm kind of gonna give you a sign angle it's still all there and this is a month old already it's lasted me and it's gonna last me several more months and that's why I love this product so what I do is I like to scoop it out with my knuckle like that and I just scoop along the edge of it like so and get a little bit of product now you're gonna rub it in between your hands to loosen it up a little bit and it immediately just melts into this lovely oil which is awesome in the summer if you're putting on your legs your arms and you're at the beach this is really really nice sheen I use obviously a lot of product you're not gonna use as much on your hands you can see it melts into the beautiful shea oil and you can put this all over you I use it on my face and my skin is actually extremely sensitive to different lotions and moisturizers and face creams this is the only thing that i use and again it's unscented 110 percent i can't smell anything at all which is really really good for me because i break out at the littlest thing and i've always been able to depend on this to be safe and to be gentle on my skin so i appreciate that now a lot of shea butters that are out there on the market have kind of a yellowish color 
I have not been able to find out if that color is artificial. I am not sure. I'm not an expert. I think there are different grades of shea. Now this was 100% authentic and as you can see, it's not colored, it's not dyed. There's no tint to it. It's 100% natural and I appreciate that because I know it's the real deal. I know that it's authentic and there's nothing in it that I can worry about irritating my skin or giving me some type of reaction. So I really, really appreciate that. And again, you can see there's a seal. It says authentic, made with authentic shea butter. It's all natural, obviously vegan. It says for all skin types, can be used by anyone. This is a great alternative for, you know, store-bought lotions and creams. You can use this from head to toe. So you don't have to worry about buying a face cream and then a hand lotion and then a body lotion. This is it all-in-one 11 ounce jar. I've used this for a month now and you can see I use this every day head to toe and I haven't used that much product. This is gonna last me at least a couple more months. It's filled to the rim. It's 11 ounces, very heavy. I take it with me. I use other uh, containers to scoop this out. Obviously you can see that it's scoopable. I've been just using a spoon. I scoop it out and put it into another container. So that is perfect for me. The lid goes on nice and snug. It's not going to dry out or anything like that. Excellent product. I hope you found this helpful. For those who are looking for a more natural route for moisturizing, head to toe, I would definitely recommend the Shea Butter.